Are you tired of switching between multiple tabs and applications to get answer to your coding queries? Or do you feel like you need someone to help you optimize your coding skills or probably help you resolve the bugs in your code? If yes, then look no further than ChatGPT. The AI-powered language model developed by OpenAI and the best part, you can now integrate ChatGPT into your favorite code editor, Visual Studio Code. With this amazing AI tool, ChatGPT, you can get personalized code suggestions and solutions. This will not only help you master the art of programming, but will also enable you to visualize multiple approaches to solve a single problem. So whether you are a beginner or an experienced developer, stay with us until the end of this video to gauge the true potential of ChatGPT and take your coding skills to the next level. But before we begin with that, I'd like to request you guys to enable the subscribe button and bell icon so that you never miss any update coming from IntelliPath YouTube channel. To begin with, we have two approaches to get ChatGPT integrated into the VS Code coding environment. The first one is to use the OpenAI library in Python coding environment and the second one is to enable a dedicated extension in VS Code. But I think the best way to get assistance from ChatGPT is to use a dedicated VS Code extension. Because first of all, you can only use the OpenAI library with Python. So there is not much you could deal with besides Python over here. Also, you'll have to generate the code manually in order to provide commands to ChatGPT, which is not the case while using extensions. So I think it's way better to install the extension over your VS Code coding environment. Now, if you are thinking how to do that, well, no worries. We'll visit the VS Code interface and show you the whole integration process to get this done. When you open the VS Code code editor, you'll see this extension manager over the activity bar. So just click on it and now you'll see this search bar over here. Go there and just insert the keyword chat GPT. And this will load the multiple chat GPT extensions available over VS Code Marketplace. Now, whenever you install any extension, you always look for either a trusted source or best rating. So if we compare the ratings, this extension named as Gini AI has the best rating of them all. So we'll move ahead with it. Here you'll find all the futuristic details about Gini and the details about its builds. You'll find details about what are the features this tool holds, how to get started with it, and you'll know about multiple commands that you can perform with this tool as well. Now, once the tool is installed, you'll see this new icon over your interface. That is the icon for our extension Gini AI. Now, once the assistant is installed, Basically, it will ask you something termed as API key. The API key is going to be tunnel or pipeline for your conversation with chat GPT algorithm. So it is critical to provide that over here. If you visit the documentation part, you'll find the directory link that will take you to the API credential section once you log in into your open AI account. So let me take you there. So now once you click on this link, Copy this link, then go on to the browser and paste it into the new window. Now, once you do enter your credentials, once you do the login process, then you'll be directed to this API keys page. So this is the page where you can create new API gateways to use ChatGPT. So basically what we'll do is we'll go into this create new secret key section and we'll create a new secret key. So let's name this as session one. And we'll create the secret key. Now this is the key that our VS code extension was asking us about. So we'll copy it and then we'll click on done. Now we have got our API key. All we need to do is provide it to our extension. So in order to do that, just come over here click on this icon that Jenny has provided and then go into the chat section. Now here you'll find this menu button. Generally you'll get the pop up when you install Jenny itself asking for API key. If you don't receive that, then you come to this menu section 
and then go into C commands button and that will actually load multiple commands over your screen. So just go and choose ask anything and enter API key. Now this will ask for your API key. So just paste the API key that you copied previously and hit the enter. Now that the API key is connected, we can start a conversation with Jenny. So you go here and create a new chart. And just to get started, you click on this icebreaker. And here you can see that the chat GPT has been successfully integrated with this Jenny extension and it is providing the results as it is supposed to be. All right. Now that we are done with installation, let me tell you about things that you could do with this extension. So just go to the Jenny editorial view by clicking on this icon over here and you'll see the list of things this assistant can help you with. The shortcuts added over here are the things that now chat GPT can help you with within the code editor itself. You're not required to move anywhere from your coding interface because of these amazing functionalities. Let me show you how these functionalities work a bit. So here is a Python program for string matching. Now I want to find a better approach to solve this very same problem. So I'll use this shortcut named as optimize for that purpose. So I'll click on optimize and chat GPT will do the rest. It will create a new program file and inside it you'll find the new approach to solve similar kind of problem. All right. In the same manner with Jenny, you can create test cases, get details about written programs, complete incomplete programs that you are stuck on and pick up all the intricacies of programming languages to become a highly skilled developer. I hope this tool helps you in your programming journey ahead. That's all I have for you guys today. I hope this session was helpful and exciting. If you have liked this video, do make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Also, if you haven't subscribed to IntelliPath YouTube channel, then make sure to do that so that you'll receive updates about more such videos coming from our team. Thanks for being here till the end of this video. Until next time, goodbye. If you want to make a career in data science, then IntelliPath has IIT Madras Advanced Data Science and AI Certification Program. This course is of very high quality and cost effective as it is taught by IIT professors and industry experts.